Timer, begin. Now you press effect, blur and sharpen, and fast box blur. Now fast box blur has three aspects. The blur dimensions, which are horizontal and vertical, horizontal and vertical. This can add a falling or a sideways motion depending on which blur dimension you pick. Now for our uses here, I'm gonna add horizontal and vertical. It also has iterations, which is the number of frames before a blur is taken away or added. So if I make the blur 17 at second zero, and I make it zero at second six, you'll see in six seconds, it's going to look as if the subject of this photo is coming into shot, is coming into focus. This adds a very cinematic and really beautiful effect to any video or photo. And as always, press effect, blur and sharpen, and fast box blur, practice this for yourself.